Hi there guys, my name's Sam and I'm one of the doctors here at 56 Dean Street and today I'm going to be talking to you about PrEP. So what is PrEP? PrEP stands for pre-exposure prophylaxis and is a tablet that's taken either daily or around the time of having sex and when taken properly prevents you from acquiring HIV. So within the tablet there are two medications, tenofovir and emtricitabine, and these are two commonly prescribed medications used in the treatment of HIV. And for those of you who have taken PET before, or post-exposure prophylaxis, it's the blue pill that you will have taken around that time. So how to take PrEP? One of the most common reasons for people not wanting to start PrEP that we come across in the clinic is that they have to take a tablet every day, which simply isn't true. Lots of people do take daily prep, which involves taking one tablet around the same time each day, and this gives you constant coverage, so you don't need to worry about when you can and can't have unprotected sex. However, for those people that are having infrequent bareback sex, you can do what we call event-based dosing or intermittent dosing. This involves taking two tablets between 2 and 24 hours before sex, one tablet the day after, and one tablet the day after that. So for example, if you're having sex on a Friday night, you would take two tablets at least two hours before, one tablet on the Saturday, and one tablet on the Sunday. And this gives you the same coverage as if you were taking daily dosing. Now whilst on PrEP, there are certain tests that you need to do before and during taking PrEP. Before starting PrEP, we like to see a baseline HIV test, and we also like to check your kidney function test and make sure that you're immune to hepatitis B. When sta after starting PrEP, we'd ask you to do a HIV test every three months, and that's because acquiring HIV whilst taking PrEP can be quite dangerous in terms of the treatment. We also ask you to do a kidney function test three months after starting PrEP, and depending on your age or the numbers that we get back, we might ask you to do it every three months or every year. But this will all be explained in your first consultation when you come to sign up for PrEP. So if you think that PrEP is for you, then give us a call and we look forward to hearing from you.